Hi everyone, in front of me I've got Redmi Pad 2 and let me share with you how to enable the nightlight or eye comfort mode. So uh, let's start with opening the settings and here in this uh, left section we have to scroll and find the display and brightness. Then let's scroll down and localize this option, which is reading mode. And that's the name of the eye comfort mode in this device. So let's simply tap on it and let's start with turning it on. So just tap on the switcher at the top. Here we've got two different modes. So we've got the cycle one, which is more or less automatic. Um, it is based on the app types and sunrise and sunset times or the classic one where we can actually customize it. So let me tap on the classic one. Now you can see that the screen turns a little bit yellowish or amber. It is in order to filter the blue light. Uh, what's more, it's much, much easier for you to look at the screen at the dim light. So if you're a night owl, then I highly recommend to use this mode. So let's customize it. Just tap on the switcher here. I mean arrow, not really the switcher. And now we've got uh, the reading mode settings. So first of all, the temperature. Uh, we can change the intensity of that feature by going to the, to the left, we can make it cooler so it is not really visible. And by going to the right, warmer. It's of course up to you which, um, which uh, intensity you prefer. Under it, we've got the texture. And um, let me just go to the cooler tones because it is better Mm, it's better uh, option to to see the texture by going to the right fully you can see that your device will apply the paper like texture to the background as you can see right now it is blurred and there's nothing here and by going to the right we've got this noisy noisy background of course it's totally up to you whether you want to use this option or not um, yeah, as I said, up to you. I'm not really the biggest fan of this option. Here we've got also the colors, um, and we can change the uh, we can check the changes on this color temperature uh, switcher. So right now we've got full colors, which are obviously vibrant and um, and uh, intense. We can also set light colors, and now you can see that the colors are a little bit dull and washed out. And you can also set black, set black and white, and everything is displayed in this monochromatic uh, look. So it's totally up to you. Uh, you can of course restore defaults if you're not really happy with your with your settings. Uh, so this is the customization. Uh, we can also schedule that feature because by tapping on this switcher, we just um, turned on the reading mode manually and. Uh, we have to use the same way to turn it off but as i said we can schedule it so just up on the switcher here and we've got two different um sorry three different options uh, from which we can choose first of all the good night's read um what uh, um sorry <laughs> two different options good night's read uh, which is uh which is location based and your device will automatically decide when the sunsets and sunrises are and will turn on the reading mode automatically or you can custom the period so you can freely choose the start and the end time and your device will apply the mode accordingly of course just tap on the option which you'd like to apply make sure that it is ticked and uh, it will be set all right, so this is the whole customization of the reading mode. And now I'd like to show you a much faster access to this feature. So you do not have to enter the settings every time I'd like to customize it or turn it on. Simply unroll the top bar. And right here, we've got the um, toggles which are connected with the specific options. We do not have really the name of the specific toggle, which is, um, I would say, quite confusing. So let's tap on edit. And now we can check uh, which toggles we've got applied and which are uh, hidden. Uh, I do not really see the reading mode here. So let's go to the system toggles. Let's simply scroll it down. And here we've got the reading mode. So just tap on this plus icon. It will be immediately applied to this first section. Oh, and as you can see, you can show the icon labels, so it's totally up to you. And then confirm it with um, the um, with the tick icon in the right upper corner. Now we've got this toggle, so just tap on it and it will be applied and tap on it again to turn it off. All right, so that will be all. Thank you so much for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and leave the thumbs up.